Hey everybody, welcome to day 25 of our Fall Back to Feeling Good 31 Day Challenge. Today we're going to focus on the knees. The knees are a joint that just gets beat up like crazy. So we're really going to show you a couple of strategies to really kind of open up those tissues and help everything above and below uh, move better so basically your knee doesn't get as irritated. So first thing we're going to do is I'm, I'm, I'm going to use a uh, foam roller here. If you don't have access to a foam roller, no, no, no thing. You just kind of use something you can kind of keep your leg elevated with. And what we're going to do is we're going to take our, uh, we're going to take both of our hands and use my right leg right here. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to take, I'm going to take my tibia and I'm going to internally rotate it like that and then push it down. So let me move this, actually move back a little bit. So basically you want to, basically you want to kind of keep this leg relatively straight and have the foam roller or something underneath your lower part of your calf. So what you're going to do is we're going to take the tibia, we're going to internally rotate, and we're going to press down and get some good extension. Internally rotate, press down, hold for about a second or two. Internally rotate, press down, and do that for about two minutes on each leg. Um, this is huge because, of course, if you have issues where your tibia doesn't internally rotate very well, especially in gait when we walk, this will not help unlock our knee. So again, the tibia bones right here, I've got my fingers on both on the outside and the inside, I'm just going to take it right here, internally rotate, and press down just like that. Alrighty? So again, it's been about two minutes on each side. Second piece of that is, I'm going to go and take my arm now, I'm going to work on this right leg again, I'm going to go and scoop it underneath my uh, back part of my knee, and all I'm going to do is, I'm just going to drive this knee forward and come back, getting some really good pressure, and opening up the tissues in front of my kneecap. So I can move it forwards, I can go at an angle, just really kind of find those nice tender areas that are really uh, loose and, or I shouldn't say loose, but really tight and rigid throughout there. And I, basically I spend about two minutes on each position, or, uh, like a, or, or, or like a, I should say on basically each leg as well. Third exercise, we're going to take a lacrosse ball, and for this one, we're going to put it and work right above the, the, the lower part of the quad where it meets the patella. So we don't want to have it on the bone, we want to have it right above the patella. So on this one, just kind of lay down, put the ball right here, put it right above that spot. And all you're going to do is find a nice tender area, put pressure into it and flex and extend your leg. And once you've gone through that tender area, then just find a new spot and roll over a little bit flex and extend, and just really work through those motions for about two to three minutes on each knee. So that's your challenge for today, and we look forward to seeing you all tomorrow.